sleep and watch out, man. Get down ball with entertainment, man. Get down. H2 TV. I'm working on a big project, which every year um, on Marcy Day, you know, I come out and I bring the ponies out, you know, and do a basketball tournament for the kids and go to all the major record labels and get, you know, free stuff to, you know, hand out to the kids. But this year I'm doing some. I mean, rather for 06, I'm doing something a whole lot bigger. I'm going to have a couple of rides out there. I'm going to do the tournament, but I'm going to have the face paint and I'm going to have products out there for kids, not just record company stuff, but hygiene products, you know, you know, free everything, toothpaste, wash cloths, you know, lotion, I mean, things that people really use and really need, and it's, it's basically targeted toward the kids. You know, we're going to have music out there, but we're not trying to get all crazy with it, you know, and bring that other element to it, um, you know, and we're also doing a trip. <clears throat> With some people who are affiliated with Deion Sanders, um, we doing a trip like the uh, the top ten kids with the best attendance and uh, best you know best report card, best marks in school. They get to go to um, Texas for the um, six to eight weeks, and every day they have a different guest speaker, recreation, all expenses paid, everything. It's, it's gonna be a beautiful thing. Like that's what I'm really doing. A lot of stuff dealing with the kids because everybody talked this rap stuff, but at the same time, it's like the, 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 the Marcy houses that we left behind, like those kids, they don't just look up to us, they need us. You know, and if we don't come back, like what good are we? You know what I'm saying? They need us. Like, they don't have nothing to do. Of course, you ain't gonna stop all the shooting and whatever's going on in the projects. You ain't gonna stop that. But at least you could balance it out, you know, with some good things. You know, get some more computers in the, in the community center. You know, uh, we've done some, we've done some um, research and found that the city only gives um, the, the community center for the kids, they only give them like $2,000 a year. And they're like 1,600, they're like 1,600 families in that project, and on average there's two to three kids. So you're talking about less than a dollar, you're talking about less than a dollar for each kid for the whole year for a recreation center, like what do they have to do? You know what I'm saying? So, you know, we got to start putting money into it. And if we don't have the money, at least get these major corporations who depend on us for their livelihood. You know, we line in their pockets every year to at least come into our communities, not just Marcy, but, you know, I can I can stretch out the Tompkins Project, Sumner, Fort Greene, Lafayette Gardens and everywhere else and get them to, you know, put something back, bring some product into, you know, into um, the projects and, you know, give these kids some projects, give them something free. Like every time I did it, it was something free. You know, in the first year, you know, um, no pun intended, I had free formerly from 106 and Park. She came out to watch the tournament and sign autographs and everything. You know, so it's something that, that's necessary and to me, that, that's bigger than all this rap shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, why are you doing it? You know, it's good to do it. What up, boy? It's good to do it, but why are, you, why are we doing it? You know what I'm saying? We doing it just to, just to get out the hood so we can say fuck the hood and live somewhere in the Hamptons or move down to Miami and, and just forget about all the people that, you know, we grew up with and their kids and their nieces and nephews and our kids and our nieces and nephews. Like, come on, man. I ain't, mean, I ain't mean to kill you with that. No, 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 you good, baby. important to me, you know what I'm saying? No, no, not at all, not at all, not at all, you know what I'm saying? We appreciate the feedback on that tip, because I know even us, even with our generation, everything, when me and my peoples, we was coming up, we was doing the hip-hop thing, more or less was watching you, watching cats like you, you know what I'm saying? It was true pioneers, you know what I'm saying? And I mean that when I say that, when y'all cats laid down the foundation and opened up a lot of motherfucking doors that wasn't open at that time, because corporate America had not even foreseen the potential, you know what I'm saying, of this hip-hop thing, and while before it even became a multi-billion dollar thing, I'm talking about you was running around doing things, Hawaiian, Sophie, and shit like that, unheard of shit, when everybody else was just trying to find a way to get on a major or whatever and just shake their ass. He was like, look, boom, Hawaiian, Sophie, look, boom, Panther shit, whatever. It was like, damn, what's that? You know what I'm saying? It was just like watching you do your thing. So watching you and I'm saying with your lineage and everything, how you came up through the ages, doing your thing, and even to now, even though you're not doing it now, streamlining your business and everything, having something there for the kids is important, you know what I'm saying, to have that in the community, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, it's very important. Um, you know, um, and um, it's, it's it, and what pisses me off also about about um, hip hop in general now is basically a, a jump in the business and 
you know, basically seducing the pockets of, of black America and then just cashing out. You know what I'm saying? Well, you, you didn't make any real contributions besides some garbage-ass music what's going on now.